Hello guys, welcome back to SheCode. So let's start with our third lab of the skill patch where we are building real world AI applications with Gemini and Imagine. So uh, the third lab is to send chat prompts using Gemini model. For that, click on the start lab button over here. As you click on the start lab button, On the left side, you will see this kind of pay, this kind of panel. Okay, we have already done two labs, so I hope you are comfortable with this panel and uh, working inside this panel. Now, coming down, here is the objective. Uh, make sure to read this so that you get an overview of what exactly we are going to do in this lab. Now. Our first task is to send chat responses without using stream. Okay, now here streaming involves rece receiving response to prompt as they are generated. Again, what you have to do is, you have to here in this code panel, click on file, click on new file and an untitled file is created. Copy the, te copy the code from here and paste it in this code section. Again, click on file. As you click on file coming down here you have save option so click on save. As you click on save now here in line number 3 you have this name of file send chat without stream.py. So copy this from here and paste it over here. As you paste it over here this will look like this now click on save. The file is created. Copy this path from here, inside this terminal section, paste the path and click enter. As you click enter, output will appear. Was our task 1, now doing the task 2. For that again you have to create a file, so click on file, click on new file. An untitled file is created. Now. Again copy this second code from here, paste it over here, as you paste the code, again click on file, click on save, as you click on save the dialog box will appear, here copy this name from uh, line number 7 which is send chat with stream.py, copy it from here, again save it here, paste it and save the file. Copy this path from here. And paste the path as it is in the terminal. As you paste it, click enter. And you will see the results. Okay. All the colors are mentioned over here. So this was our lab, here after uh, running both the codes, click on check my progress. You will surely get the green tick. Now before ending the lab, I will recommend you to please go through the manual and read it once so that you will get an idea what exactly the lab was on. So after getting a green tick and 100 on 100 over here, you can click on end lab over here and end the lab. Thank you. Bye-bye.